Jesus. Welcome back to SOS. I'm Staff Sergeant Badass. And Sippy Cup was feeling sad. So I'm going to cheer her up. And how I'm going to do that, she always likes it when I make stuff out of leather. So, hmm, you know, there's there's all sorts of holidays. There's birthdays and things like that, I mean, for people. I mean, you could make stuff at any time. And it's always good to be able to do this stuff. And I never know when I could probably cheer somebody up. So she's been having a pretty rough day. She hasn't been feeling good. And uh, I just wanted to do something to kind of lift her spirits up a little bit. Give her something to hmm, show her I care, I guess. I guess I could just say I care. But I'm going to make her something. And I'm going to show you how to make it. So uh, let's do this. Okay. So I think I'm going to make a bracelet. Let me move this stuff out of the way. It's kind of in the way. I don't want this here because it makes my life a lot easier. But just set it out of the way. There we go. I have practical workspace here. Here we go. Whoop. There we go. Chaos. Hey, look, I am the camera crew. All right. I don't. I can't hire a bunch of people to move stuff around. And I definitely am going to sit there and edit. All right, here we go. Yes, I'm done moving stuff now. All right. So her wrist is, mm, say, about a little bit under seven, but I need a little bit of room, and I want to make an overlap. So I don't want this to be really big, and I think because if I have an overlap, I can overlap it like that. I'm going to make something really cool with some rune stones. Let's see. That should work. Doesn't have to be perfect. Something just uh, a little bit wide. Sort of fashionable. She could wear it around. She's in. She's in college, so she might. I mean, I might just leave it like that. Those edges like that. Let me see. Let's see how that looks. Yeah, not bad. Yeah, shave a little bit off there. Yeah, sometimes when I'm bored, I like making stuff for people and they have no idea I'm going to do it. At least I turn it how I wanted to. There we go. Yeah, not bad. Just like that. Now see, I don't have to make stuff fancy all the time. I don't have to make a bunch of crazy stuff. I was going to make a uh, little sheath for this little knife here. It's just a little throwing knife. I mean, uh, but I mean, it's in this dumb thing. I don't like it. So I'm going to make a sheath for that. I'm going to probably do that later. Now, all I need to do now is take my punch and right about there, just sort of center a button on there and see kind of where you want that guy to go. And then get your hammer. Y'all. Make an earthquake. Just like that. Flip it around. You could use this one to center the other one. Well, you kind of know where you're going here. Just leave a little mark. You should be able to see the divot. And then just come back. Another one. Just like that. Hey, it's a workbench, okay? Let's get that out of the way. I don't need it. Don't need scissors. <coughs> I'll need the hammer in a minute. <coughs> Let's see. Punch this through. Nah, they're wadding it out. All you gotta do is just ram back in there. And then you got your hole. 
put your button in. Now with this one here, got my hole. Put my button in. It's just going to be coming around like that. So I just put my button in like that. I got a fancy little button. There we go. Now I like I like putting the male version on this side and the female on the connection side. That's just how I do it. It tends to last forever that way. And just make sure you got a good punch in there and then bring this one over just like that. Look, see if it snaps okay. It's gonna be nice and stiff. That's good. It's not gonna. It's not gonna break. There we go. All right, now I got a nice little snap going on there. Now I'm gonna do something really fun. Let's see. Sorry about that. Stay still over there. Stop moving around. All right. Now I might need my pen. I won't need any of this stuff, so I can put it up. Get it out of my way. Well, I'll have more workspace. All right. I might need the pen though, so I'm keeping it out. All right, so I got my little chart. Let's see. Let's take a look at this chart. Here we go. All right, so I want to put her name on here in runestones. I thought it'd be pretty funny. Uh, so you got your S over here. So I put my S just like that. Uh, I kind of draw it on there. Like that. Okay, sorry about that. I had to, every one of my kids want to come, come play, but Mama's in there with them. Anyway, let's see. We got our S and our I. The I is just a line. Just like that. All right. And then, and you might not be able to see it that good, but once I put the hot iron on it, it'll probably show up a lot better. Alright, I got my P. Now, P is going to be weird. It's going to be really hard to do, but I'll get it. So, that's the P. That's that weird shape right there. Like that. Like that. And then I do another one. Like that. That, 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 and that. Alright. Two P's. And then I gotta do my Y. My Y is kind of funky. So I'll do a funky Y. Like that. And let's see. I might be able to put... Go ahead and put the cup... Sippy cup. That. That. Find the U. U. Then I find my P. Again, same weird shape. And there you have it. Now, I can put this away. Put my pen away. And let's, let's cook this baby. All right, just put your hot iron on there and you've already got it drawn out, so I'll just sit there and smell the leather cook. I think she'll get a kick out of this. 
She always loves this crazy stuff. There's a secret to sippy cup. She used to go to renaissance fairs. Not kidding. Yeah, that's one of her secrets. It's not really a secret. Everybody knows. She's into that crazy stuff. Vikings and all that history stuff. She's always been kind of into that. She's been a history buff. Time I known her. She had more guns than me when we met. She blew my mind. And the day we met, I gave her the name Sippy Cup. And you could do this uh, for any loved one you have. It's so cheap, so easy, and they will have something you made for them. And it'll mean more than anything you can buy. I could go to any store and buy some crap and give it to anyone. Or give someone a gift card or whatever, you know what I mean? But when you make something for someone, it really does show... From the bottom of your heart that you really do love them and that's something to always remember all right let's put this in my holder all right guys gals yeah it looks pretty crazy huh but that's rune stones and well rune markings and it says sippy cup i know it looks pretty crazy but anyway it snaps together and then goes around the wrist. People will have no idea. But she will know. That's all that matters. Hang on a second. Alright, guys, gals, children of all ages. I hope you enjoyed it. Just something I'm going to make. and Well, I've made and I'm going to go give it to her and see the smile on her face. I hope. Maybe she'll throw it at me. I don't like it. I highly doubt it. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, you're watching SOS. I'm Staff Sergeant Badass. Uh, please like, subscribe, share my videos, and stay alive. And please don't die, because then there's nobody to watch my videos. Take it easy.